directly from Mr. Benson, the owner of the New Orleans Saints. Mr. Benson is an extremely Catholic man. Mr. Benson has donated literally tens of millions of dollars to Catholic churches, to uh, religious communities. He, he, he done all kinds of stuff. And so, I love Mr. Benson. You know, at the Saints game, if they ever pan up and show you Mr. Benson in his box, normally got a wall of nuns waiting in the front. Because you know, we stay prayed up in New Orleans even during the football game. And so, Normally, you know, I'll end up sitting by two nuns. But you know, when I go to the game, I never dress like a priest. Never. Because I've been a Saints fan my whole life. It took us 43 years to make it to the Super Bowl. So, I've been through the 1 in 15 year. I've been through the bag heads year. I've been through going to the game and, you know, you're losing and the last second field goal. I've been there with y'all. So, I know that there are times when I might jump up and say something that should not flow out the mouth of a priest. <laughs> and so I never wear a collar because if I jump up and like, you know, talk about killing, just killing, it'd be my father. So, so I try not to, 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 you know, wear my collar and nothing to the game. But the Holy Family Sisters, which is a, a religious community of African American women founded in 1841, the Sisters of the Holy Family, when they go to the game, they where they have it, they be all nothing down with the veil, they had everything, all that, all that, they put all that on. And so, I remember one time I was sitting by two of the sisters of the Holy Family, and we were watching the game, but, but there are three guys behind us. And all they kept saying was, ain't no way we're going to have fun with these nuns in front of us. You can't, man, we can't get drunk, we can't cuss, we can't do nothing. So they decided what they would do is they would try to antagonize the nuns to make him want to leave and go to another spot. <coughs> so one boy turned to his friend and said, you know what? I think I'll go to Washington. Because I heard they only got 20 Catholic people there. <laughs> the second one said, well, you know what? I think I'll go to Iowa. You know what? You ought to go to hell. They ain't got no Catholic people there. 